Oh hi guys, me again. Yeah. Uh I just wanted to share you guys share with you guys some new um footage from Hawaii with the current eruption that's going on there now. And I'll fill you in as much as I can. So um yeah, here we go. <laughs> So far, so far the eruption has released more than a hundred million cubic meters of lava and has added about 700 acres of new land, which in square kilometers would be, uh, let's see, just a moment, divided by about three square kilometers of new land to to the island and um there's been another eruption at the uh, Kilauea summit uh last night and the the the, the um, crater itself has also um, increased in size and area as well. Um, I will see if I can get some footage of that. So let's continue. <laughs> been made and if I'm not mistaken I believe there's the source of the eruptions of the lava that you see here which is about 23 kilometers away well not directly more like yeah. Now all this here used to be water. or so ago when the lava first entered and all this water here is now covered by lava well not literally covered but it's been displaced by the lava Um, called Kapoho. Um, and the eruption source is in the Lelani Estates. Um, so it's it's uh, this eruption is called the um, Lelani eruption, if I remember correctly. And about seven hundred homes have been destroyed so far by the eruption. Yeah, sorry for all the pausing, um, but um, yeah, here's a good aerial footage. Um, 
of um, before all the lava came down. You see, as I said before, this is where the this is the day when the the lava actually came into the ocean, and all of this land here up to roughly over here is now covered by lava. Yeah, and um, this is the source of the all that lava in the Lanius Lakes. have opened up in the area and if I remember correctly it's these These are definitely new fishes that have opened up um, quite recently, um, just about a day or two ago. one of the new fishes that opened up eh, on of that new eruption.
Kilauea volcano has left scientists baffled after the aerial footage showed concerning changes within the main crater at the volcano's summit. A drone mission has alarmed scientists monitoring the erupting Hawaii volcano, which has become one of the world's most dangerous and volatile sites. Kilauea has shocked the world with streams of lava swallowing houses and giant fissures opening up across Hawaii. The latest aerial drone footage of the volcano has revealed dramatic changes within the volcano spotted at one of Kilauea's main craters. There are new alarming cracks and faults seen in a collapsed crater, some of which are spewing with intense steam. Scientists are concerned that an expanding collapsed crater in the debris blocking the vent could trigger a massive explosion. The Halemama crater has undergone a sudden transformation since the eruptions began in early May, including the surprising disappearance of a lava lake. The drone footage from the U.S. Geological Survey USGS, shows yellow sulfur substance on the rubble-covered floor and a scattering of large ballistic blocks around the crater rim. USGS official Okay, this is actually old footage from before the eruption began about two months ago. So, they're just, um, this, this is just how the lava lake looked like before the eruption. Before this newest eruption. ...revealed that the empty vent once housed a 12-acre lava lake up until a few weeks ago. The vent is currently empty of lava and has been stretched to massive 100 acres. The boulders blocking the crater's eruptive vent have stopped huge clouds of ash emerging, but the consequences are unknown. Kyle Anderson, a geophysicist with the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory, Set experts are uncertain whether this could end eruptions or cause another bigger explosion. He said, we really don't know the implications of this long term. It's possible that new explosions will blast through the rubble at the bottom of the vent. These may or may not be larger than the previous explosions. It is also possible that the vent may become permanently blocked, and whether this could end eruptions or cause another bigger explosion. He said, we really don't know the implications of this long term. It's possible that new explosions will blast through the rubble at the bottom of the vent. These may or may not be larger than the previous explosions. It is also possible that the vent may become permanently blocked, ending the explosions entirely. The depth of the crater is not yet known. This comes as volcanologists showed that the month-old eruption on Hawaii's Big Island has entered a new, quieter, calmer phase inside the crater. So, um, <clears throat> so I just wanted to um, share you, share with you some of the latest footage. Um, yeah, um, as you may have noticed, I edited some, some of these clips together. Um, um, from several different sources. One is from the um, yeah from the U.S. latest news, and the other one was um, let me just uh, sorry guys, I lost the I lost that first video where I started off. Um, sorry, I lost it, but um, yeah, the 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 uh, one video that I got is from the um, that um, U.S. news, um, but the other one when I started off, I unfortunately um, don't know where to find it anymore. I lost it. Sorry about that, but um, this was just a. Uh, um, a bit of an update on what's going on in Hawaii. So, um, I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one. So, bye bye.